everyone and welcome to Lakeside Living. Today I'm going to be showing you a fresh thyme market haul for some healthy food. So let's take a look at this food. never bought there before called plant-based pasta red lentil and sweet potatoes it's gluten-free it's non GMO high protein and it's vegan so I'm going to be using this um, in some recipes probably just for me um, on the back it says rustic cauliflower pasta and it gives a recipe so I might be doing that in a video just so to give you people some gluten-free um, recipes if you've never been to Fresh Time, um, you ought to give it a try. It's, it's a great store, and a lot of this, this, uh, these products have some recipes on the back. So that's the first thing. Second thing uh, that my daughter found was fresh roasted, lightly seasoned um, cassava, cassava strips, and they're barbecue. So we're going to go give this a try. Uh, we've never had those at all. And... Um, it's supposed to be very, very healthy for you. An, another alternative just from a regular potato chip. Second, or third thing I guess we bought is the Fresh Thyme Organic Salsa, thick and crunchy, and we got it in the mild. Uh, none of our family really likes anything that's spicy, um, so it kind of bothers us. So we're going to give this a try. There again, I've never had this brand um, from Fresh Thyme, but we all love salsa. So I'll have to let you know in a previous video uh, what I found out about this. The next thing that I bought two of is the Dillman Farm family owned, since 1970 it says, or 100% organic apple butter spread. Now I have had these before here at home. Um, I'm really the only one that eats these, uh, this uh, apple butter. Honestly, I like to put it on waffles. That may sound stupid, but I really think it's great. And it's made in Bloomington, Indiana. And it's 100% organic, so the sugar content is only 2 grams. And like I told you before, me and the sugar, uh, fake sugar, granulated sugar, really don't get along all that well. So this I seem to tolerate very, very well. So I got two of those today. Another thing that we're going to try that was new was this Bar Harbor Clam Chowder. Now, they only had one of the ready-to-use um, in a tomato and clam chowder juice broth. And it's just uh, water, clam juice, and then it has potatoes, diced carrots, diced tomato, celery, tomato paste, onion. And we all like clam chowder, so we're going to give this a try. And then we also bought the condensed version, so we'll have to add just a little bit um, of some other ingredients for that. but. Overall, we think we're really going to like this brand, so we'll have to give this a try. I also bought some almond flour, baking mix, pumpkin muffin, and bread. Um, it's the only whole food ingredients, nothing artificial ever, by Simply Mills. And so that I might be fixing in a future recipe here on my channel, just to show you, um, you know, how to do it. It only takes eggs, water, and oil, plus this mix, and it says... Um, 15 to 20 minutes until muffins bounce back and like I said 350 degrees so it doesn't take long to fix these and I thought there again that would be good for me. Uh, the last couple of things I bought were their Simply Mills, never had these, almond flour, crackers, rosemary, and sea salt. And I'm going to be taking these to work this week and giving those a shot and so a lot of this stuff I guess I'll have to come back on and tell you my review about it. And Last but not least is the Pure Gum. I've got the Peppermint and the Spearmint, and I have shown you these before. They're aspartame-free, and I just absolutely love them. So there's no sugar in there of these for me. Um, the fa my favorite is the uh, Peppermint. The Spearmint would be second. I think it also comes in wintergreen. So with that all being said, that's basically my outing today at Fresh Time Market. Um, I would love to know if you ever shop there or what you buy or if you've tried any of my products. 
and please stay tuned for future videos. Like I said, I may be making some of these recipes or trying these products and giving them a shot and a review, so you'll have to check back if you want to go out and purchase the same things. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel, ring that notification bell, and like this video. I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.